Local activists rallied in the rain in downtown Pittsburgh today, calling for protections for members of the black community and those who identify as trans. Royce Jones has a reaction from some of them now. Royce. Well, Kim, those who showed up to this rally called for better investments in black neighborhoods, organizations, and schools, but they also demanded more movement on behalf of politicians and police to solve and bring justice in homicide cases involving members of the black and trans communities. Today, dozens of people stood in the rain, lining Grant Street outside the city county building, demanding justice for members of the black community who have lost their lives to gun violence and black trans people who have also been victims of violence in the region. If we do not come together, we're going to continue to be in the same space with our loved ones dying from community, from police, because of the systems. The systems that are put in place to keep us oppressed as black people. She means people like 19 year old Amari Lee, a trans woman who was found gunned down in the streets of Wilkinsburg on New Year's. Members of her family were here for the rally and say the investigation into her death has shown no progress. I play present on Amari's mother who has not had a rested moment since Amari has been taken from our lives and from her life and from her grandmother's life. And all Many of the speakers here expressed feeling failed by politicians and demand their voices be heard and families who have had their loved ones taken from them get justice. How can you be murdered by the police and it called an accident? Trans Uniting, the Alliance for Police Accountability, Black Lives Matter Pittsburgh and One Hood helped organize this rally. And organizers said there will be more actions like this in the future and encourage more people to get involved. Kim.